Girl, you better stop playing. Go get them box of wigs. Y'all ready to turn these into some headbands? Yes! channel i'm your girl miss christy christina with a k hey christina with a k hey 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 girl hey boy how you doing how you feeling i'm coming to you with no makeup on <laughs> guys this is a video on some more headbands yes i wanted to do a video on some affordable headband options these are some looks that i'm pretty sure you absolutely have in your house and I also wanted to do a video to show you kind of how you don't really need to beat your whole face, okay, to make it look right. So let's go ahead and jump right into this video. So we are here, we are back. Are y'all headband out at this point? Because um, I'm not. <laughs> yes, so I wanna show you guys a couple of looks because I'm pretty sure you have these headbands in your house. You guys have this stuff in your house. You have it, you have it. I know there are a lot of different headband options floating around and I know you probably feel pressured like, oh, where's my credit card? I need to go buy this, buy that. But I wanted to do a video as a follow-up to that video that I did last week on the human hair unit, I wanted to show you guys some affordable options, okay? And I also wanted to show you guys without any makeup. So this is the first time I'm coming to y'all with no makeup and um, I like it, I like it a lot, okay? I felt like I needed to make this video because there's so many times that you will watch a video, me personally too, looking in and you feel like oh my goodness where's my credit card i need to go buy that or i want that i want that but right now it's a pandemic it's a lot going on outside of the pandemic sometimes we just need to realize what we have in the house and i wanted to show you guys some looks okay so i pulled up all the wigs that i kind of had in this one box i got this wig box it's called my throw the wigs in the box box <laughs> As much as I wanted to go and buy a whole bunch of wigs for y'all and half wigs, I said, Christina, why? Why are you doing that? You have these wigs. So the wigs that I'm gonna be talking about today are a couple oldies and goodies. And these are some that I have reviewed before and some that you probably not have seen on my channel or some that I wear personally. Okay, first of all, before we get started, I am coming to you guys bare face. Check out my Skinny Sundays video if you wanna know how to have the skin that's glowing like this okay i'll leave a link right here i have a whole playlist on skincare so it's okay you can you can get skincare too sis next i feel like sometimes you don't need makeup for certain wigs but there's times where i walk around in my personal life without makeup and i actually prefer to not wear makeup in my personal life i walk around with no makeup but there's times where you know you might you might want to spice it up a little bit put some earrings on slick your edges back girl put some lashes on you don't need to but stuff like this makes it where it's like you don't really need to put on makeup but it makes it kind of enhance it a little bit and definitely do your eyebrows put your eyebrows on girl you know ain't nobody gonna take you serious if you don't have your eyebrows on so shout out to miss amore and this lip gloss right here just in case i forget because i have short-term memory this is what i'm wearing right now on my lips and these rings right here, guys, these are from Deanna Monet, okay? Monet Dior Couture, okay? So I'll leave a link to all of those below because I feel like just certain things you need, like maybe some earrings, maybe some rings, maybe a little bit of lip gloss, and it could complete the look. You don't need a whole bunch of makeup because I know when I run to Target, I am not beating my face. I don't even, I barely, you lucky if you get some lip gloss on me. <laughs> so let's go ahead and talk about this first one i already put it up in a ponytail but this first one that i have here i'm in love with this first one guys this first one here is from sensational and the style is called miss jolette and i have the color 1b this right here is that go-to kinky textured 
unit that you would look like it's your hair and you just put a headband on so i love the way this texture feels this is a textured unit okay so it's kind of giving me like nisha vibes but yet it's really soft it's kind of giving me like connectalon but not hard connectalon but definitely soft textured hair i like the fact that this one has like curls on the side here so the side has like these curls here right here and here are y'all seeing that so the side like has these curls right here and right here so i like that effect of this one it's not looking like like nisha like just straight it's kind of having some kind of curl to it and it just looks so natural this looks like my hair this is what she's looking like in the front she's kind of long but you can always trim this down i am getting some shedding from this wig but you know you can trim her if you need to the back is definitely longer but she's still cute she's a vibe she looks like my hair it just like you can walk around the house looking like this with these headband wigs and these half wigs so this is a half wig this is not a headband wig this is a half wig you can put these up depending on the type of headband that you have i like the thicker ones i've mentioned it in my other headband video before i like the fact that the thicker ones you can hide the back and put it up into a ponytail so let's go ahead and put her up into a ponytail so i didn't show you guys but this is a half wig okay so it's really dense right here and the beauty of turning it into you know a headband half wig is that you just conceal this whole part right here with the headband okay so i know they have half wigs and it's nothing new with half wigs but honestly guys i used to wear half wigs when i first got introduced to wigs but i used to leave my edges out and the thing with half wigs is that you used to leave your edges out and try to conceal it to make it look more like it's kind of like your hair you used to do something like that girl stop playing i know you used to do that <laughs> but the beauty of this whole headband craze is that it's like you can put a headband on i don't know why it's like something that we're now discovering in life like this new oh my goodness so you can put it up like this and kind of just look like I've been cleaning the house all day ponytail or you know you could look like messy bun like ooh, my hair was in my way let me put it up in a bun kind of vibe this is so easy so simple look at it let's go ahead and jump into another one so this next one that I want to jump into let's go ahead and take this off Ooh. so i do have a cap on okay it's just to kind of protect my hair and so it doesn't snag and i did go ahead and do my edges the way i did that the last time i used my edge booster and my got to be glue gel today i used the she is bomb and my got to be you can use whatever you want girl use whatever to slick them edges it's not really it's kind of not as slick today because i didn't set it i ain't set it right so this next wig was my favorite go-to curly wig. I wore this wig so many times and it was been sitting in my closet and I forgot about it until I saw Deanna Monet do a video like this and I got reminded how much I loved this wig. I wore this wig, I don't know if you guys know, but I was on Ellen, I was on Game of Games, Ellen, season two, episode four, check me out. And this was my Ellen wig. Every time I go to the show, I go to Ellen. I used to go watch the show a couple times and I used to wear this wig. Like my friends used to call this my Ellen wig. <laughs> okay, so this is the Peruvian Outre wig. As you see, she's worn. She's definitely worn, but that's the beauty of this half wig and wigs in general. Like sometimes these curly wigs look a little bit better to me when they look older and yeah when I used to wear this wig I used to leave my edges out I used to twist the front and leave my edges out and make it look more like my hair I'll leave a picture right here of how I used to wear this wig but headbands are in 
And I don't know why we are acting like they just invented headbands. <laughs> this wig right here. I absolutely love this wig. This was my first half wig that I ever bought. And I remember going to the beauty supply store and it used to be sold out all the time. All the time. Because everybody wanted this wig. I bet if you look it up right now, it's going to be a lot of reviews on this wig. So yeah, the thing with half wigs is you used to leave your edges out, twist it, and blend it in to make it look more natural. So now, we on this headband craze. Let me show you what's about to happen. For my little headband haul that I got, I told y'all I got a whole bunch of headbands. I'm going to do this one right here, and we're just going to cover it up. <laughs> oh my god. I don't know why we're acting like this is a brand new wig like look at that you just put this headband on <laughs> it's like magic <laughs> and that's it but i really like this outright peruvian one because as much as it tangles a little bit you know it just looks so natural i get so many compliments on this wig when i wear it people are in love with this it kind of gives like human hair vibes i'm not even going to attempt to run my fingers through there because they're going to get lost we already know let's change the headband yellow is such a pretty color on melanin <laughs> it's like magic and it's just such simple look at that <laughs> let's go ahead and jump into the last wig so this last one is buddy unit number four i actually have worn this one in one of my skinny sundays videos a long time ago as a headband and didn't even think about the headband craze i just wanted to show y'all like a shorter option i'm gonna go with this headband right here this little one right here i like white i like white and yellow headbands i just feel like it just makes it look so nice so this wig right here is one of those wigs that does have a lace. But girl, if you don't feel like melting, if you don't feel like melting, <laughs> put her on your head and put your headband on. All right, and that is that. Look at that everyday look. You don't need makeup. You don't need a lot. So the point of the video is that you have these wigs at home if you are watching this video you probably wear wigs and if not you know there are affordable options out there you can get some half wigs but don't go on a big splurge right now with this big headband craze yes there are some ones that probably will hold up a little bit longer than others like more human hair ones that are good quality but you have this stuff in your drawer sis you have this wig sitting on your couch, sis. <laughs> so I really had to do a really deep analysis within myself and realize that I have a lot of these wigs sitting around the house. And all you need is a headband, okay? And some lashes and some eyebrows. Because ain't nobody going to take you serious if you don't have your eyebrows on. <laughs> yeah, so I'll leave a link below to all these different headbands. Ooh. Ooh, ooh, uh, why am I always coming up with stuff at the end of the video? Headband wigs are, yes, the new craze right now, but you can do this. There's so many affordable options. You can get a really nice, high quality headband wig, or you can just work with what you have. And right now, because we're going through a lot of stuff with the world, we're going to work with what we have, okay? I'll leave a link below to the headbands of all the different headbands that I have. There's so many different options of headbands. You can switch it up. I have this light, nice little cute bag of headbands. It was like $20 on Amazon or stick ones too. I'll leave a link below to all these headbands, depending on how you want to wear the style. I feel like getting different headbands makes the look look a whole lot different. Also too, depending on like the accessories you have, like today I just threw on some lashes and I did my eyebrows. You don't need to do that, but sometimes the whole look can put together, you know, depending on the headband, the lippy, the wig, all of that. I have so many other wigs that I can go ahead and show you guys, but I think that was a good like little variety of a nice show and tell. Let me know how you guys are feeling about this video. And until next time, I'll talk to you later. Bye.